Hey, fish people, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to look at a cool pool of convenience that you can just slap on the side of your tank and get a rough idea if something's going to go wrong. It's the Seachem Alert combo pack here. So, the cool thing about this combo pack here is it's going to give you one for your pH, one for your ammonia. pH one, not too big of a deal, but the ammonia one's the one that I was most interested in. This is something simple. You slap it on the side of your tank, inside the tank, you pull off a classic little film. And it's going to slowly, you know, change the color of the dial in the middle, kind of like a moon ring. If the ammonia, for whatever reason, spikes up too far, this is going to change for you. Same thing with pH. It's going to slowly show where the pH is for you. So these are what they look like on the fish tanks themselves. It's just a little suction cup. You got to take a clear plastic film off of there and there. We just kind of stick them on. You see we got a couple different colors here. So right now we're this color, so we're safe. It'll go up to this green, blue, or this deep blue here as it changes. So that's the ammonia one, which is for fresh and marine. And over here, we got the pH alert one. This is just a freshwater one. Again, this is inside the tank. You'll notice here, this color is going to match up with one of these. So you can see the pH of this tank is about 6.6. .6. These are going to be good, you know, if you want to get a new tank. That's so why I put them on here. I got some new white clouds in here. Just to keep an eye on the tank, make sure there's no major ammonia spike or anything in here. That will kill these little guys. It's more of a safety net for someone. If you don't want to be testing your water all the time, you just take a quick glance over at the little indicator there and see where you're sitting at. The only real downside I can see to this product is if people think testing strips are less accurate than the liquid chemicals, these would probably be one more removed from the testing chemicals. It's not going to be as accurate as the testing chemicals. And it is, you know, limited by how much they can put on the dial. I know my water comes out of the tap at 6.5 and settles down to 6.0. While it's in my tank, it's not going to give me the most accurate reading until things have settled. Right now it's reading 6.6 .6 on the little dial. But I know that if I tested that water, it's going to be closer to 6.5 or a 6.3 or even a 6.0. So it does take a little while for this to adjust. So it won't give you that exact accurate reading but it will let you know roughly what the ph is you know i would say plus or minus a 0.2 now the ammonia one has a much more smaller scale than the testing strips or the liquid chemicals the ammonia scale starts down at 0 0.02 parts per million then it jumps itself up to 0 0.05 ppm then it gets to 0.2 ppm, and then finally 0.5 ppm. So whereas something like your liquid hit, the ammonia on that starts at zero part per million, then it jumps up to that 0 0.25, 0 0.5, 1 0, 2 0, and goes up that way. This one has a much smaller scale to it. If it senses anything between that initial zero parts per million to 0.25 part per million, as our liquid test kits have, it'll give you a little more early warning on it. If you want to try and pick these up for yourselves, give them a test run. You can get them off of keepfishkeeping.com. That's where mine came from. There will, of course, be a link in the description and pinned comment of this video if you want to check this out on their store. Do I think they work? Yes. Do I think they're as dialed in as accurate as the test strips or liquid chemicals? Yes and no. It all depends on what you're testing for. I think the pH one is going to be a little off just because they couldn't put as many different colors and range on it. The ammonia one... The tank I have in it, it's not registering any ammonia. My liquid registers no ammonia. My test strip registers no ammonia. So for right now, yes, it's accurate. I'll have to look back at it. If this dings any ammonia, I'll then go back and test with the liquid and see how accurate it is. But for right now, for as accurate as they can be for something that you just set it and forget it, just to give you an early warning system if something's going wrong in your tank.